Hi, my name is Chantry Banks. I'm from Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, uh, but I grew up in western Oklahoma in the small town of Hammond, which is uh, south of here, uh, south of Alva here, and I grew up on a farm there. And uh, the sewing arts have been a part of my life from as long as I can remember. My mom was a sewer, uh, but I learned how to sew. My, my, my quilting origins began uh, in 4-H club uh, when I was nine years old. Uh, the first uh, project we ever did was making a pair of elastic waistband shorts. That was the first time I ever sat behind a sewing machine uh, with Mrs. Orgain. She was our 4-H instructor. And uh, I will always be grateful and indebted to her for teaching me a skill that has stayed with me um, for uh, close to uh, 40 years now. I didn't sew much after that, after the couple of years in 4-H, but when I went to um, undergrad, undergraduate school at Southwestern Oklahoma State University in Weatherford, I was involved in the theater department and started working in costume design while at Southwestern. Uh, and hence my sewing skills got put to use uh, for many years at Southwestern. And uh, still no quilting, but sewing and learning um, type, all types of sewing skills. Uh, and then I moved to Florida in 2005 for grad school for acting. Uh, but while I was there to supplement my income, I worked in several costume shops uh, all over Orlando, Florida. And uh, from there, that's when I started uh, as a side business, creating um, small uh, quilted uh, purses, clutch bags, I call them. Um, and so that's when I really started getting into quilting. And for me, when I first started, the louder the pattern, the busier the pattern, the more interested I was in, I was, the more interested in it I was. And I also really loved um, all of my bags, my signature, I guess, my quilted bags, besides the loud, busy prints. I loved giant vintage buttons. So those were all, those were a signature of my quilted bags too. From there, from those small quilted bags I made, I started branching out into um, pot holders, which is basically just a tiny version of a quilt. And from there, uh, my quilts got bigger and bigger and bigger. And uh, here we are now. And uh, I am making uh, crib size quilts, um, art quilts that hang on walls, and full size and larger quilts uh, in Oklahoma City. I consider myself a modern quilter. I consider myself an improv quilter. That means I don't work with uh, patterns very often, or if I do um, use patterns, they're patterns I create myself. Um, I love color very, very much. Uh, all of my work is represented, I think, by all the color that I use. Uh, and I have recently uh, started um, <laughs> uh, stepping away from the busy um, patterned fabrics that I have loved for many, many years. I still have a stash at home that I'm never going to get through, but I have started working in solids. And uh, several of my pieces here on display in Alva um, are pure solids, and I'm really, really pleased with how they are turning out. Um, I'm a member of the Oklahoma City Modern Quilt Guild. Uh, we meet monthly in Oklahoma City. And um, it is a mix of traditional quilters and modern quilters, and I'm highly influenced by the men and women that are part of the Oklahoma City Modern quilt guild. I also have a small group that we quilt with, that I quilt with once a month. We have a great time together. And um, I would say my style is, like I said, modern and improv, but I like taking traditional blocks or traditional quilts and kind of blowing those up and blowing those out to where um, they are modern and almost unrecognizable. Um, I'm really excited that here um, in Alva at Graceful Arts, it's my first showing ever, uh, my first gallery show ever. So this is a big stepping off point for me. Um, like I said, I still make my little quilted bags. Uh, I have an Etsy store, that I, an Etsy shop that I try to keep up with, um, but finding me on Facebook, I do sell my things on Facebook. And during the holidays, I make a lot of um, quilted stockings as well, and those are available as well. But I don't have any, uh, I don't have a storefront or sell any place in Oklahoma City just yet, uh, but Alva is my, is my debut.